Called off. Repeat, abandoned search. Return to control. Maybe they should try voting. I suppose. One with the best up. Oh my god, take it. You want the call? Take it. Any word about how it's going in there? How do you think? Vito's taking his beating. Wish Greco would just let us kill the post some bitch and get it over with. Nah, nah, Greco wants us to show how tough he is. Beat on old Vito until we all respect him. Only all it took was beating up on a washed up carpet bagger. Somebody sneaking around. Okay, then where you wanna look? You and me ain't getting paid enough not to worry about right, Walt. 
You know what I mean. Look, I get doing them coons over in the hollow. Hell, bringing that dumb cracker rich to you makes some kind of sense, but Vito's was made. Was made. Word come down from on high that Scarlett is out. And that means he's out. Anyway, Greco might be stupid. He might not even be crazy. But right now, he's the one calling the shots. Huh? Hey, bro! Hey, you okay? Fuck. Got lots of places to look. Get this. Don't wanna split you well. Shit, fuck him up. You need bro to got your attention now. This shit. Let my old dog go now.
No luck. Moving on. Like I got here just in time, Vito. Lincoln. How's this possible? I thought you were dead. The bullet was deflected by my skull. Came out the back. Talk about some goddamn luck. Worst place to shoot it, fellas, in the forehead. The skull's harder than you think. <clears throat> Come on, huh? We need to have a talk. When I heard about what happened, I went to Marcano asking my cut right then and there. I figured if he fucked you and Sammy, I'd be next. I'm guessing he didn't go for it. Said he wanted to wait for the heat to die down. Didn't want me running around, around buying expensive shit, getting noticed. Like I'm some fucking amateur, never sat on a big score before. That money I front for the robbery was pretty much everything I put away. Didn't have enough to run, so. I stayed. The commission wouldn't let him just kill me, so I figured I'd make that cock Suska jump through every hoop. Make him prove I deserve to get whacked. It wasn't much, but it was something. Heard he brought his nephew to push you out. A kid named Michael Greco. Nephew by marriage, not blood. Sure didn't the number in here. Yeah. They were looking to see what other rackets I was running. I could leave a fucking paper trail in my offices. Eh, nah, don't bother with that shit. Look, uh... Appreciate you getting me out of the freezer and all, but, uh... What are you doing here? Marcano deserves to pay for what he did, so I'm going after him. Him, his brothers, his lieutenants, all of them. And I'm gonna need your help. Look, it's pretty much whittled me down to nothing. I mean, this is it. For now, maybe. But once I just take back River Row from Greco, money will start coming in, it'll be a different story. Also, a ball office now. As long as you do what I say and give me what I want when I want. <laughs> so goodbye, Marcano, hello to Lincoln Clay. It's either that or more of this. And the next time, I won't be around to fish your ass out the freezer. That scumbag with me. You bring me Greco. I'm in. Tell me about his rackets. He took over the dock union and he's got a warehouse. He has a lot of valuable shit in there. You can take both of them out. Greco's finished. A couple of my guys have been keeping tabs on him. You should talk to them. They'll fill you in. All right.
Hey, Lincoln. I'm, uh, still trying to get this place back in order. You should think about trusting me with a little more territory. Vito says you should help me get this bread of my mind to a safe place. Sure can, honey, and a friend of Vito's is a friend of mine. Be there like this split. What can I take off of your hands? Better not lose this. Going straight to the bank. It's wetter yep. than a cucumber yep. in a calm van. It's better my right to vote. Whether it goes the way I'd like it in the point. It's our chance, no matter how slight, to have a voice. Possibly. Vito says you're reliable. The only thing I've ever blessed would be a young woman's undergarment. She and her husband were having trouble conceiving as she thought it might help. It was a little awkward, but that little girl was... Vito said you'd be expecting me. Took you long enough. I'm Jock Blanchard. Vito claims you can unfug this mess and get us working men back on a job. Maybe. Depends if your information is any good. You used to kick up to Vito's men Andy Toretto for union work. But now that Coyon Greco got Andy squeezing everybody for more dues. You don't want pay, you don't get a work permit. Poor fucks, he's even gotta use Greco's loudmouth buddies to collect. This Greco sounds like a real piece of shit. <laughs> you don't know the half of heaven. On top of that, Andy's got to keep the permits under lock and key. Anything happens to those, oof. Ain't no work happening around here. I'll see whatever I can get out of Toretto's people. It's a tight ship. You should be able to get some of his guys talking. I've been working for Vito for a while now. You ask me, my kind of never gave him a fair fucking chance.
end your miserable life. Gonna cut your fucking heart out. Me. Rain clouds are amazing. <laughs> Shit, is that check the other side? Hey, take it my shot! Cabin must have took off. Maybe he doubled back. Okay, then. Where did you want to look? I'll probably catch cold. Out of the way. Uh, hey, watch where you're going. But my upstairs neighbor can be more. Secret to good gumbo? Not seeing you again, young boy, brother. With the bones. Is it raining again? Right. What do you think you're doing? Glad to see those ears of yours work. to get married. 
Vito sent me. You're Connie, right? Yup. Connie DeMarco. Been keeping an eye on the smuggling business for Vito. Roy Thibodeau's in charge now, and it's a damn shit show. Why hasn't Greco bounced him yet? Oh, he bounced Roy right into a hole if he got it to say so. Greco didn't pick Roy, and that puts a target on his back. Still, Roy's trying to sell the usual shit from out of Cuba. Cigars or some rum, mostly. Hell, rumor has it they even selling medicine and shit to the Cubans. Sounds like Greco scrambling. <laughs> Imagine Greco thought his uncle Sal gave him a break, but no. So he's squeezing everyone, including Roy. If business gets any worse, Roy's gonna have to come down and see to it himself. Mine, Roy's got a few guys here and there. Might take some persuading, but I'll get him to talk. 